Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is in collaboration with Lindsay Dormer from Dormer Homes and Heidi Sambo from Happily Thriving Heidi. So they are doing their fall challenge and it is so much fun. It is my first time participating in this challenge and I am super duper excited about it because fall is my favorite season. You may hear my daughter in the background because she's literally sitting right here and it's about after six in the morning. <laughs> so the challenge video basically is a decorating with me uh, collaboration and the title of it is the Fall Farmhouse Decorate With Me Challenge. And I did not get to film a decorate with me video because my camera was, you know, broken. It wasn't working. And so I had to get a new camera. Um, but I was so excited when Lindsay and Heidi both posted the invitation to do this challenge. I was already in the process of finishing up the space. So I did not get to film a decorate with me in detail but I will show you guys around the space and kind of give you guys um, some background as to you know what the process was and my inspiration and where I got certain you know items from and everything like that but I just want to say first thank you so much to Heidi and to Lindsay for having this open uh, collaboration and for Heidi for personally inviting me via email I am so excited I absolutely love these ladies their channels are absolutely amazing they are all about interior decorating and design and DIYs and budgeting saving a buck who don't like saving a, a dollar I absolutely love saving a dollar and it's also about family and vlogging and just having a good time and showing you know your create creative side of who you are because as women we have so many different layers and I am just I just love their channel I've learned so much from watching them and I binge watch them all the time because I just love them so much. So their uh, channel links will be in the description box below. Make sure you go ahead to their channels and check them out. Let them know that Shoshana sent you over and subscribe to their channels, you guys. Don't forget to press that bell because they upload some amazing budget saving, cleaning, you know, decluttering videos. It's just absolutely amazing. I've taken part in some of Heidi's challenges, cleaning and decluttering challenges, and let me tell you, it's amazing. It literally helps you to focus and to prioritize the things that you need in your home. And so I am just so excited that they have taken this time to invite, um, invite us and that we can participate in this wonderful challenge. So make sure you go ahead over to their, cha their channels and subscribe and share their videos and also Check out in the link, uh, the description box below, there will be a playlist of so many other wonderful, creative, and fantastic ladies that are taking part in this challenge. So thank you again so much for uh, Lindsay and Heidi for having this challenge or hosting this challenge rather. Um, so without further ado, I'm just going to get into the video. So today's space that I am designing or decorating is going to be my dining room. So let me give you a little disclaimer. I actually, my husband and I, we just purchased our home. Um, we've been in the house now for about maybe two and a half months. So everything is still kind of a work in progress. And this room is probably the most finished room. It's not complete because there are some things that I still want to do to it. I still have to add a rug and change out my light fixture. But for the most part, it is complete and I am so happy with the way that it turned out and I hope that you guys will absolutely fall in love with this uh, space as well. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not yet done so. If you're coming over from Lindsay or Heidi's channel, I, I love having you here. Welcome. Uh, subscribe if you see something that you know you like and maybe you want to continue with um, this beautiful family that I have here on YouTube I would love to have you would love to have you subscribe 
Also, don't forget to hit that bell so that you will be notified whenever I do upload videos. You will get that notification um, in your email or your feed or, you know, what have you. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay guys, so welcome to my dining room space. This is my little collage picture wall. It's not completely finished yet. I still have some more pictures um, that I'm going to be posting up. So this is my beautiful bay window. I've always wanted one and the view is absolutely stunning. You will see that later on in the video. So my inspiration is that picture right there with the goose um and the pumpkins i love that it's a thrifted item i did thrift it from home um not home goods <laughs> from um goodwill um a few months ago and i just love it when i saw that i knew immediately what my color scheme my theme was going to be for the fall and I just love the way that it turned out. This is my beautiful shelving unit. I found the shelving unit in Target for $60, you guys, and I just love it so much. It's given me so much space to put all my beautiful thrifted items on, and I just love the way that it turned out. So these two frames I also thrifted from Goodwill and I don't have any pictures in them as of yet, but I just love the warm tone uh, that it brings to my dining room. Also, I wanted to just give you guys like an up close, um, you know, view of my chair rails and my moldings. I just love my home, you guys. This home is a canole, can canole. This home is a colonial home and I just love it so much. I love the texture of this wallpaper and it's in my entire dining room. It's just beautiful. I did not want to replace it. So when we came in to the home, it was already painted this color and I just didn't want to change it because it warms up the space and it just you know represents me the way that I decorate so just giving you like an overview of what is on my shelf here I basically thrifted I want to say 95% of the items that's on the shelf is thrifted from the Salvation Army from the Goodwill from different um, thrifting stores and I just love the way that it turned out those mirrored uh, picture frames, I did get those from Hobby Lobby. Uh, they were $50 a piece, but I got them for 50% off each. So I got them for $50 each. And this beautiful pumpkin, um, I did purchase it from Marshalls a while back. I want to say about maybe two years ago. And I don't remember the price of it, but it was under, um, under $20 so was this pumpkin as well and i just love the message and um just the look of it that it breathes um in my home we are a christ-centered home jesus is lord of our lives and we take pleasure in serving him and make sure that he is upfront and personal um, in everything that we do, especially in our personal space. Um, and so you're going to see a lot of um, him represented in my home. If you subscribe to my channel and stick around, you'll definitely get to see the um, process of me decorating my home and you know, you'll definitely get to see him. Well, Jesus you know, represented here in our home. So a lot of these items are thrifted. Um, my milk glass items, the vases, the beautiful copper lantern is also thrifted. And I love thrifting, you guys. I just, I love the process of it. I love the process of finding things. I love the ability to find beautiful, unique items for less than $10, most of the times less than $5 and i just i love the way that this turned out so i'm kind of giving you guys just a glimpse of each shelf um you know step by step and kind of what i have on each shelf so this little fall sign i did get that from the dollar store i believe uh, three years ago i think and this was a diy um that i made i just printed his will his way off of my computer and kind of just um designed it a little bit and 
hung it up on that little frame there. And this as for me in my house, we will serve the Lord basically speaks for itself. This is our life. This is what we do. This is who we are. Jesus is Lord of our lives and I just love him so much. And this is just my everyday life. I have mints there, my daughter's hair tie. So as I'm giving you guys a tour of my dining room, we live in the space. We eat here every day, at least, you know, three to four times a day. So this is this is what it is <laughs> you may see a few little things i'm sorry guys that's my daughter um here and there but i just wanted to you know add a little bit of fall stay within the neutral tones and normally i am very traditional with the colors the, the deep rich orange and deep rich reds and but this year i kind of just wanted to tone it down a little bit um you will get that on my front porch which you will see um if you do subscribe to my channel i um will give a porch front porch fall video um soon to come so like I was saying, the shelving unit, I did get it from Target for $60. And I just love the way that it turned out. I love all the items on there. And most people may think that it's overdone or it's crowded, but it really isn't. There is a rhyme and a reason to the way everything is set up and decorated. So this beautiful lantern, I did go ahead and get two of them. I got those from Target as well. And they were $40 a piece. Normally, I don't spend that much on a lantern, but the camera is not doing it justice as to how large it actually is. It looks amazing in the space. That's the second one. And I just love the way that it turned out on my wall. So this is my fall tree. Every year I do a fall tree. And this one is just very minimal and simplistic. And I just love the colors and the tones and the muted orange and the muted yellows. And yellow is my favorite color. So I try to incorporate it in my decor um, throughout my home. But I just love the way that this tree turned out. It is a rose gold copperish tone kind of tree. And the theme in my entire house is copper. Besides it being the fall season or the holiday season, that's just, I love copper. So it's in my kitchen, it's in my space, everywhere in my home, um, just little touches of it. And so I just wanted to incorporate that with the tree and um, keep that muted, um, natural, neutral tone going through. As you see, my yellow pumpkins, it's my favorite color, you guys. So I had to go ahead and incorporate that in my design. And this is what it looks like at sort of like the dawn or not the dawn, but the, you know, the end of the day. I wanted to give you guys like a total night shot, but I didn't have time to film a total night shot. So I kind of just wanted to show you guys what it would look like once like the sun is going down. Um, this is basically what my tree looks like um, at night and it just... I just love it it's so warm and it's so welcoming and it screams fall to me it's neutral but it screams fall to me and I just I love the way that it turned out this year so this beautiful piece right here it's um, two different pieces into one so uh, this uh, bottom piece of the dresser is an actual set uh, with a hutch but I broke the set up I went ahead and painted this um, but for most of my subscribers you probably will remember this hutch I did have it in the top of my staircase in the old home and it was more of a brown warm tone so I went ahead and painted it white and this mirror you guys is actually from my bedroom it came with my dresser but I wanted to break up the piece because I love to shop my home and I put it all together and created just one beautiful furniture piece and it looked amazing I love the way that it turned out I went ahead and added some glam you know to the space because I do love a little bit of glam and um, I went ahead and added some glam to my farmhouse decor and I guess you could say that it's a my style is in between traditional farmhouse urban chic 
<laughs> um, I do have a little bit of French country twist, but I absolutely love farmhouse decor. I don't like when it's too much of it everywhere, but I just love um, a modern touch of farmhouse. And so this three tier tray, I did um, thrift as well from the Salvation Army. I wanna say three, four years ago, um, I got it for $7.99 and I do believe that it retails for about $49 um, or $30, something like that. And most of the pumpkins are from Dollar Tree. Some of the pumpkins are thrifted. Um, and from Marshalls as well. So there goes the picture up close and personal, you guys. I love this portrait. It's so beautiful, it's so chic, it's so simple, but at the same time, it's, it sort of brings me back to nature. All the noise in the background that you hear is my daughter. I do apologize for that, but um, I just love it. I love it, and this is my inspiration for the fall season for my entire home. Um, I just love the neutral. Um, I just love the neutral uh, take on it. So I love the way that this piece turned out. It's absolutely gorgeous, and I am. I'm. I'm loving it, you guys. I love this space. I love the way that it looks. Um, and this is my view. This is my dining room view. This is what we see every single day as we eat um, and as we sort of just go around, you know, the table and fellowship. So I found this table runner in TJ Maxx and it was $19.99. I love the neutral tones. It appears to be a little bit yellow because it is but it's so neutral, it's so chic, and it's super farmhousey and gorgeous, and I'm just, oh, I'm just soaking it all up. It adds such a beautiful touch to my space, and I just, I love it, you guys, I love it so much. So these pumpkins I got from Walmart last year, and the pine cones I also got from, I believe it was, Marshalls it came in like a package a bundle and I picked up about six of them and it smells amazing it literally smells like cinnamon and apples love just love the way that it makes my house smell and these are my little tea light candles at night I turn them on and it just looks so beautiful at night um, with everything all the lights turned off and the lights outside and it just, the ambiance is absolutely incredible. My leaves are falling, my uh, they're changing colors, and it just looks so gorgeous. So I just wanted to go ahead and give you guys just a overview of my dining room space. And also just to remind you to go ahead and visit Heidi and Lindsay's channel and all the wonderful ladies um, that's taken part in this playlist. Don't forget to subscribe to their channels and don't forget to uh, share the videos and press the bells. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press that bell for new uploads, um, notifications that uh, you will be receiving. Don't forget that Jesus is Lord and that he loves you so much and I love you too. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you, thank you again, Heidi and Lindsay and happy fall you guys. Have a wonderful day.